Hi, I'm Angela St. John, and today I'm doing an, an activism project on food and utensil safety in the kitchen. First, for the pot to handle, you do not want to have it out because someone could walk in and knock it over. And second, little kids could, could come over and grab it, and then they could knock it over. So that's why you gotta have it in. And, and here's another thing. For the bigger, I have three knives. I have a chef knife, a, santu, a santoku knife, and a paring knife. For the chef knife, you can use this for bigger foods, and for the smaller one, you can use smaller because it's a lot safer. Now, if you're less experienced and, and you're a little bit nervous, use the santoku knife because if you're less experienced, you could hurt it because it's smaller. Now, when you cut, you, you have to have your fingers down and curled. So when you cut, you will not take off a finger. You're only going to scrape off a little. If you, have, if you do it like this, you're going to take off a finger. <laughs> okay. First, if you have milk, if you're going to use it, you always got to check the expiration date. Then, if you leave it out, it could get chunky and it could get all sour and no one wants, and no one likes sour milk. And that should always go into the fridge once you're done with it. Mm -hmm. Now, for example, like for the eggs, if you don't, if your eggs are not fully cooked, that could have salmonella in it, and that could end up getting people very sick. And the last thing is, you always want your counter and utensils clean, because if you don't, um, the um, stuff from the utensils and the counter could get onto the food, and then that could cause people to get sick. Okay, and the last thing is, if you're cooking and your oil's on fire, put the lid over it. But if it's too much, you gotta come over to your fire, fire extinguisher and put it out so your house won't catch on fire. And, and I really hope you consider all the things I've taught you. So when you go into the kitchen, make sure you do the things I told you. Because if you don't, people are gonna end up getting hurt or getting sick or getting severely burned. Thank you.